November is going to see quite a few sporting battles and the one that's got many world over excited is the World Chess Championship face-off between China's Ding Lijian and India's Di Kukesh. For a few months now, Ding Lijian's career has taken a bit of a nosedive. Contrastingly, his opponent, Di Gukesh, has seen dizzying heights, one win after the next. In fact, Gukesh has already roped in a mental conditioning coach, Paddy Upton, to help him prepare for this challenge. The irony? Lejeune is facing the heat. He has openly admitted recently that he is worried about losing badly to the Indian prodigy. What has Lejeune's troublesome journey been like and will he be able to get his act together and turn the tide round for the final showdown? Take a look. Di Gukesh and Ding Lijian are gearing up for the World Chess Championship finale. The duo will compete in a 14-match day competition in Singapore later this month. But is the quest to be crowned the world champion an even one? Because the build-up to the mega finale has been quite different for the two finalists. On one hand, Gukesh is high on confidence given his impressive run through the year. And on the other, Lijian has already put his sword down and is worried about an embarrassing loss. I'll be the underdog approaching this match. I'm worried about losing very badly. Gukesh is in top form recently. He's the best player in the Olympiad. I hope I can become a totally different player. At least to fight, to slow down his pace, to have some winning chances. Given the kind of form Gukesh is in, he is the favourite walking into the tournament. The 18-year-old dominated the candidates tournament and the chess olympiad earlier this year, which made prominent voices feel that Gukesh will become the youngest to be crowned world champion. And Lijian himself is accepting that he is the underdog. That too just days before the intense showdown. This just goes to show the mental state the current world champion is in. Lijian came back after a long break due to mental fatigue earlier this year. And following his comeback, he is in the same force that he once was. Lijian is in the middle of what he calls his longest unwinning streak. The Chinese player hasn't won a classical game since the Tata Steel event in the Netherlands at the start of 2024. And more than the results, it's the mental barrier that Lijian is stuck in. In many ways, the mental roadblock is responsible for the slump the current world champion is experiencing. Something even world number one Magnus Carlsen has highlighted. I think people realize that the world championship is a very tough thing. What I think happened with Ding is that he has not completely recovered from that world championship yet. You can sense when Ding plays that he is lacking confidence. He's apprehensive in his play. It's not just confidence that Lijian is lacking in his game. He's also showing all the signs of a lack of interest and frustration because of the results this year, which has the world champion down in the dumps. Maybe I'm not so eager to play. I don't have this ambition to win the game. Every time I came to the playing hall, maybe I was not in a very good mood. And after the game, especially if I drew the game, I realized I missed a huge chance. I'm not so happy with the results. This goes in a circle from time to time. Lijian's season is exactly the opposite of how Gukesh's career is shaping up to be. The Indian Grandmaster is on the upward trajectory, working on every aspect of his game, converting those wins into confidence and adding more tactics with each game. Gukesh is leaving no stone unturned in his quest to become the world champion. He has even hired mental coach Paddy Upton to strengthen the psychological aspect of his game. The South African coach was part of India's cricket team which won the World Cup in 2011. And Upton has a long history of being involved with Indian athletes. He was part of India's hockey team which won a bronze medal in the recent Paris Olympics. With Upton's rich experience, he stands to be the right coach to help Gukesh prepare for the crunch moments at the World Championship.
Combined with his winning streak and Upton's coaching, Gukesh's Chinese counterpart has a lot to worry about. Confident, composed Gukesh is ready to walk out and face Li Zhen with more tricks than we've ever seen before. The only silver lining for Li Zhen is the fact that his last win came in a tournament where he beat Gukesh. But will the memory of that victory be enough to inspire an underconfident Li Zhen? Because Gukesh won't go easy on him. The Indian is looking for redemption. Gukesh is coming for the historic title to cap off an already amazing year.